there's a process of accompaniment which happens. And it, it needs to be an encounter with Jesus Christ, but through you, through Ananias, through your team, and letting the team really work together. So I would have a discussion with each of our team members, and I'd actually meet with every single candidate that was about to enter the RCA process to just know where they are and what do they need. Uh, so the suggestion to you is to have the RCIA go year-round. Now before you panic, think of the months of June, July, and August as maybe just one session. One session. So you stay connected to those folks that you're going to be walking with throughout the whole year. But it needs to go year-round. And if somebody is not ready, if somebody's not approaching discipleship, if somebody's still struggling in their faith, we can wait to give them the sacraments of initiation. They can happen any time of the year, by the way. Any time of the year. Because we have special circumstances happen all the time. I mean, we had folks that had annulments and stuff, and we had to wait until their annulments were granted. But once they received their annulment, I wasn't going to make them wait until the next Easter. So we brought them into the church on a particular Sunday, and the community can receive them and bless them. But 
those four questions he gave us at the end are going to be what he's going to ask us. How have you made disciples? Have you baptized all nations? Have you taught them all that, you, that, that I've commanded you? And 